everybody. Welcome back to The Horror Show. I'm Marsha Barker, live at Phoenix Comic Con 2017. And I'm here with T.C. Fenwick. How are you doing today? Doing great. It's been a good show. Yeah? Yeah? Any, what's your favorite part so far? Meeting all the crazy people. Yeah. Yeah, just crazy. Crazy people. <laughs> uh, it's crazy. good times. Crazy. A lot of horror fans coming your way? Oh, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Um, a lot of people interested in Halloween and all that stuff and buy masks already for Halloween, you know? Yeah. Awesome. Never too early. Yeah. Now let's talk about your work because it's really cool. It's definitely horror uh, oriented, right? Oh, yeah. Um, draw a lot of inspiration from Edgar Allan Poe, H.P. Lovecraft. So that's pretty much my main inspiration right there, those two guys. So, uh, a lot of uh, classic horror movies, um, Vincent Price, anything with that, yeah. So what is what is your favorite horror genre? Probably H.P. Lovecraft's work, yeah. just, just in general. Um, I'm not a big reader, but I love short stories. So H.P. Lovecraft, with most of his stories are all short, so they're just kind of straight hit, get to the point, and then I'll just take that, use my imagination from reading his work. So tell us about your art. You do drawings as well as the mask. As leather mask and sculptures as well, yeah. So um, I started off as uh, just a drawing, sketching, and then moved into painting. From painting, went into sculpting with clay, and then from sculpting with clay, went into leather leather working and leather mask making. So uh, a lot of times leather, you can get it to do a lot of things. It's a lot more comfortable, so I'll usually use leather for the most part. Um, it's a lot more comfortable to wear, it's lightweight, it's, uh, you can do a lot of things with it, and um, it just seems to work easier for people. People seem to enjoy them a lot more, and it's unique, so. And do you do custom work or commission work, or is it just uh, whatever comes to your mind? I do as long as um, I feel like I can do it. <laughs> I get some outlandish uh, ideas that people want me to do, and you know, it drives me a little crazy trying to come up with it, and then I, I have to back out on them. But for the most part, it's um, it, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll attempt to do some things that people will tell me, but uh, most of them are just my own ideas and creations. So yeah. Your most favorite piece so far. Actually, I had it. I just sold it yesterday. Um, it was it was a Cthulhu giant Cthulhu head, and it had the, I did the eyeballs out of uh, a glass, and they were it was it was beautiful looking. And unfortunately, I don't have it anymore. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that was that was probably my favorite leather mask that I've I've made so far. So where can our fans find your work? Uh, you can find me at uh, Facebook uh, T C Fimwick and um, inst uh, Instagram uh, T C Fimwick's Arts. Uh, yeah, um, I have an Etsy shop, TC Fenwick's Art. Pretty much TC Fenwick Art all around. Just Google that and you'll find me. Thank you so much yep. for doing this interview with me. Um, and you guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you continue to watch all of our footage from here at Phoenix Comic Con. We've got tons of stuff coming your way. And remember, stay Thanks scared. Care. Awesome. Great job. I don't know why I did a backwards handshake, but it was no, pretty cool. No, that was cool. Yeah. yeah. I'm a little ambidextrous. Yeah, I like it.